All right, this video describes how to take care of Heidi and Venus and Mama while I'm out of town. First, we'll do Heidi. I'd like for you to feed her at the farmhouse because she might try and eat the cat's food while you're feeding them at the chalet. So each morning at about 9 a.m., you're going to feed Heidi and you can feed her dinner around 6 p.m. And I'm going to leave some food for you. First thing you're going to do is you're going to take, get a big tablespoon, big tablespoon, and get a big old heaping tablespoon of this food and put it in Heidi's bowl. Then you're going to take some wet food from the refrigerator. It'll be in a big can like this. It says blue on it and it'll have a little plastic lid on it. You're going to get about half a tablespoon of this. Just about half, just about half a tablespoon, not, not a whole tablespoon. And you're going to put it in the bowl with the dry food and just mix it up. Just mix it all up together for Heidi. And that's what she eats in the morning and the evening. So it's all in the same bowl there. Just mix it all up for her. Now the cats, what you're going to do when you visit them is just come on in and spend some time with them and hang out with them for a little bit. Once they're comfortable around you, um, you can feed them. And I leave food out for Mama all the time. Remember, Mama's the big cat, Venus is the little cat. And I leave a wet can of food out for Mama all day long. and. Um, Mom, I'll leave some extra cans for you. And Mama, she just likes to lick the top of the food, right? So look at that. She's just been licking on the top of that. Each time I come visit her, I take a knife and I just stir it up. I get those juices from the bottom up to the top and I just stir it up for her. She likes it when you stir it up and activate those juices and the smells. And she'll go through about one can a day. Just go ahead and give her a new can every day and throw out the old can, even if there's a little food left in it. And you can just leave this on the kitchen floor in the chalet. And I also leave dry food out for Mama, the big cat, all day long. She can have access to this all day. Now Venus, she's a smaller cat, she eats a different kind of food. And Mama is not allowed to have any of Venus's food because it's bad for Mama's kidneys. Venus's food is in the bathroom at the chalet. I'll show you. So once Mama is eating her food, see if you can get Venus to follow you in the, in the bathroom just like this. And you're going to close the door so Mama can't get in. And Venus might want to flirt with you for a few minutes before she eats. But when she's ready, open the lid to her dry food. And Venus will eat her dry food. This is her food right here. And once she's done eating, put the lid back on the dry food. It's very important because... We can't let Mama get to Venus's dry food. And you just need to feed the cats um, once in the morning, once in the middle afternoon, maybe, you know, two o'clock, one or two, and then once before you go to bed. So that's three times a day, morning, afternoon, and night. And you don't have to clean out their litter box, and they should be just fine on water. And... Um, that should be about it. Thank you so much for taking care of the babies. Love you.